Hey guys, it's Wayne from Sling Pilot Academy. Had an absolute blast at Oshkosh. Uh, I've got a video to share with you that we, we actually created for our video wall at Oshkosh. Uh, we've got a brief tour of our build center. We've got some friends of Sling that we're featuring and also some great footage of our aircraft, including the new high wing. So enjoy the video. Hi guys, welcome to Sling Custom Bulls here in sunny LA. I'd like to show you around the place a little bit and uh, show you what you can expect if you're gonna come do a build here. So this is the facility. We opened this and got this going about a year ago. It started off with one aeroplane in here and we thought we had a lot of space. Then it ended up a little while back with six aeroplanes here. And we've got the flow rate going and we're getting them out the door nicely, nice and quickly now. You can have a look over here. Everything's nicely set up. We're nicely organized now. We've just moved the bays along. Every so often, um, every week or two, we'll move aeroplanes along here. We've had a little bit of a hold up with um, shipping, which seems to be a problem worldwide. Otherwise, these would already be full of aeroplanes. Um, over here, this aeroplane is just about ready to get its instrumentation in. As you can see, the engine has been installed, all the piping, everything. Sean, our guy that uh, does the engine install, is doing a superb job. Everything is neat. I would say he's doing a job as good as the factory, if not a little better. Inside here, you can see this is the stage now where the customers have gone home and this airplane is getting ready to get the instrumentation in. Once the instrumentation's in, it gets the windshield on and then it goes off to the paint shop. So day one when you arrive, if you, if you come when your kit arrives, it'll go into spot one over there. You'll do an inventory of the whole kit and you'll start building. The first thing you're gonna build then will be the empennage. Week two will be putting on your undercarriage, your engine mount and getting your fuselage onto the wings. And depending on how much time you spend in that session, but the next week you would do the wings. On the wings, you get the wings from the factory. All the riveting work on the wing is done. You put in the end rib and the wing tip. You put in your wiring for your, your lighting and you build the flaps and the ailerons. And basically, and then you would test your fuel tanks for leaks. Then you rivet those on and that's your wings done. So by the time you leave here after two or three weeks, your initial two or three weeks, or week and week and week, however you want to break it up, whatever works for you, You'll leave with an airplane basically looking like that, your empennage kit done, and your wings done. Then, depending on your level of involvement that you want to partake in, you could leave the airplane here, we'll finish painting it, we'll have the instrumentation put in, and we'll finish the engine. Your next involvement needs to be when we do the final assembly, which we're going to go look at the hangar next door now, and you do the final assembly. What will happen there is the wings go on, We'll test all the systems, we'll calibrate the fuel tanks, we'll do weight and balance and calibrate the fuel tanks, and then we'll jump in and we'll have the first startup, that magic moment, and do a little run up, check instrumentation, and then shut down, check for leaks, check for anything out of the norm, and then we'll taxi around, we'll go drive around the airport a little bit, do, go down to the holding point, we'll do run ups, we'll do the compass swing, your magnetometer calibration, come back, check everything over again. Everything getting perfect at that point, we'll bring it back in the hangar. And then one of the fun things we do here is, unfortunately, because LA is so built up and the area around Torrance Airport is so built up, we'll take your wings off, only the wings off. We'll put them onto a truck with a fuselage and we ship it off to Temecula, French Valley, where we've got a beautiful airfield, nice facility to do the final assembly. We'll get the DAR out there and we'll finalize the paperwork, get our special flight permit. And that's where we do that magic first flight, a nice area, not built up, so nice and safe if anything goes wrong. You know, one of the beauties about these airplanes, although they're in the experimental category, there's not much experimental about them. Um, you know, the engines are proven, the airframe's proven. We've built a lot of them, so we, we kind of know what to look for, make sure we can get that first flight off faultlessly, so it's a safe and enjoyable and memorable um, experience. And um, yeah, that's uh, 
Hard works here. We can go along, let's go and hang next door and have a look at the kind of finishing off of these aeroplanes. Just kind of here, we like to keep everything organized, all the parts here on a board like this, all laid out. If you're looking for anything, you can come through your board, it's all laid out in order. It's all barcoded, you can find what you need easily and quickly see um, where everything is. We're very lucky because we've got a very nice facility. This hangar became available a while back. As you can see in the back there, we've got this nice spray booth installed. We're just waiting for our screw compressor. Then we'll be completely independent. We won't have to go anywhere. We'll finish the aeroplanes in these two hangars. This year, everyone knows Whiskey Tango. This is where it all started, where Wayne and uh, Matt went over to South Africa to build this plane. And um, just getting a little bit of maintenance work done here. This here is the next aeroplane that we were getting off the production line. Um, this is just getting some engine work done. It's uh, nearly, nearly complete. Some, this is really exciting stage. If you have a look in here, the parachute rocket is in. They're busy finishing off gluing in the upholstery. The side panels are fitted, getting ready for the instrumentation it has been fitted. It's been installed. We just take the screens out while we're working in it. So this is the next airplane. It gets wings on next week. And um, as soon as the, the upholstery is finished, and then we'll run it, and that'll be the next one to go out to French Valley. So this is it. This is the facility. Come join us. Come build airplanes in LA. Grabbing the keys. I am now fully liable and responsible for this place. It's yours. Thank, Thank you, oh. Mike. I appreciate it. Go, well, got the keys.
Uh, so the video we're working on right now is gonna be our trip to Oshkosh. So my daughter Jess, she passed her check ride on the Tuesday and then flew Matthew and I to Oshkosh on the Wednesday. So I'm really impressed with her uh, and the video is gonna be an absolute blast.